Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of The Witcher, where, yep, there was a ledge. A very cleverly camouflaged ledge. There's something over there. Hello? Oh, trolls, hi. Don't seem too bothered by me. Cooking something. Play for him. Play me for the man, then. If I win, I take him with me. If I lose, I'll jump in the pot, too. Good! Good! <laughs> <laughs> what? What? No bubble! <laughs> First riddle. Not eat, not drink. Big E, B. Stick, big E. Big he bash! Mm. Troll. A troll, of course. Uh, That's an easy one. Troll. Now you ask. I'm light as a feather, but even a troll can't hold me for long. Huh. <laughs> So they're, they're keeping true to their word, at least. Uh, I, uh, I'll manage. Let's get out of here. You all right? Never go in a sauna again, long <laughs> as I live. Other than that, I think I'm fine. You saved my life. How can I thank you? I'm looking for Hjalmar. Hjalmar? Curious where he is myself. Him and the whole crew. Something must have happened. Mm. Otherwise he'd have come looking for me after I went missing that night. I know he would have. Wait now. Why are you looking for Hjalmar? Mm. Krok sent me here to find Hjalmar. New king will soon be chosen on Ard Skellig. Everybody's waiting for the young on Crane's return. So it started already? Hjalmar, ruler of all Skellige. Doubt he's cut out for it. Hjalmar's irresponsible, <laughs> stubborn, and heeds no counsel. But he's a born leader. Been mates since we were lads. With him, man, Ceres. Ceres has put forth her claim to the throne as well. Ceres? But she's... Well, she's... Just like her father. Like father, like daughter. What about Crack? He support her? He let her set off on some daft quest. Wasn't thrilled. Especially since Ceres set out without telling him. Nor did she tell me. Where'd she go? Who'd she take with her? Speaker Og. And no one. She went alone? Damn the dogs! If Yalmard only... Has she come back, do you know? Hadn't returned when I left Ard Skellig. Yeah, tell me what happened. The expedition. Tell me about it. Started like the best ballads. With a hearty storm. Sail whipped about like a rag. Finally caught sight ashore. But then sirens attacked. 
as if they'd just been biding their time. Oh yeah, but he has been boiled, isn't he? Somehow, I know it. If not for the bloody helmsman. What did the helmsman do? Helmsman made a mistake. I'd say his ma made the mistake. Birthed them our sways or something. <laughs> Dim that one. Heard tales and was so afraid of sirens he stuffed wax in his ears. Failed to hear our warning calls. Steered us right into the rocks. Lost a few men. Had to drag the wounded on litters. And the sirens pestered us the whole while. Yalmar kept blowing his horn. But we'd come too close to the hillside and he brought an avalanche down on us. Not your lucky day, it seems. The horn. That's what, what I found. Next? We found that daft bugger in the ship. Then pitched camp near the guard tower. Things seemed to calm. Mm. How'd you get separated from the others? Had to watch for the night. Saw Egnar of Faro steal Yalmar's hornwall horn. One he uses to drive away sirens. Oh. Bugger snuck out of camp. I followed him. No idea what got into that ginger head of his. Told Yalmar not to take him with us a thousand times at least. And? You catch up to him? Aye. In these caves. Bastard screeched so loud he drew the trolls. Thought the buggers would eat me right then. Dropped me in a marinade instead. Decided I was ready to cook today. Would have been the end of me if not for you. No problem. Any idea where Yelmar thought he might find the giant? We learned where it has its lair. In the middle of the village. Yalmar decided the best way there would be to cross the lake. Viggy the loon insisted he knew a better way through the mines. But none of us fancied strolling into a monster pit. Oh, I'm okay with that. Think I know enough. So long. Wait. I'll go with you. Luckily the trolls didn't use my bow for kindling. Yeah, I could use some use, use an archer Let's back up. Good. Let's go. Oh, I've got to keep him alive, really. Come on, dumbass. Oh, he's really coming with me, isn't he? If he didn't have the health, like, the health bar, I'd be alright with it. But that means I've got to protect him as well as try and fight everything. Ooh. Here's the lake. Let's have a look at the map. Looks like I follow it round. This should be safe away. Rather than just swimming across it. Which I would normally do. You know, direct approach. And just lock. Oh, no. Examine the boat. Hmm. Probably plan to repair it. Yeah, something doesn't feel right. Race. 
essence of wraith. Lovely. Um, Archer buddy, where are you? Do not know where he's disappeared to. <coughs> what now, you will But the fact that his health's not going down is a good sign. Oh, I'm following the wrong quest. Hang on. in this game will probably teleport to me. Before. Guess you could say I've never been fond of Clan Tudorok. In fact, no one in Arch Skellig's especially fond of them. Hmm. You claim Ard Skelligers don't like the people of Unvik, yet you helped them after the giant attacked. When you see a drowning man in a storm, do you ask what clan he's from first? Point taken, I guess. That's true. But your people gave them shelter, and now you've come to kill the giant. Of course we've come. Winning back Unvik's the best way to get those folk off Ard Skellig. Any clan out there Ard Skelligers are friendly with? Well, certainly wouldn't be those Brockvar cowards. They'll say it ain't so. Till a hundred years back, their Jarl walked them off the battlefield just because the enemy showed in greater numbers. And Faro folk are cheats and thieves. Everyone knows it. The Twirsek of Ard Skellig always been too big for their britches. Now, Madman Lugus's clan. They're all right. Funny. Thought they were your greatest enemies. <laughs> they are. But we just can't respect the other clans. That's fair. Let's get going. 
I guess. Emerald dust. Nice. Anything else in here? Right. Uh, lots of loot balls. Oh, hello. Footprints. Oh, wait. There we go. So I don't even get an audio bit because it's bugged. Great. A bit over here. Um, hmm. Right, now can you actually examine it properly? Nope. Okay, then screw you, game. I ain't following your objective markers, I'm following the footprints. Hello, beasties. Need to find another way. God, I wish I had some of those night vision potions. That's just loot. I've got myself stuck in a cave. Perfect. over here Ah, I see a treasure chest No, 
bit behind it. Here we go. Didn't cut. That probably went flying. Sliced her up. Two men looks like. Oh shit. That was an explosive barrel. I see daylight. Been here before. In fact, no one. Am yeah, I didn't mean to talk to him. Let's get going. Oops, hang on, I'm encumbered. Just. Anyone else? There we go. Come on, Foland, you got one to deal with. There we go. Just a stress fire. Seriously, income at this time. Ah! 
Whoa! I forgot those things explode. If that's the way out, what's down here? I think we found the trolls home. Oh, gods. Near twenty of them. But no Yalmar. Get out of the way. Show me a pantry and I'll show you the mice. ran out this way. And 
And that's a new quest. Is it monster armorers or something? Master armorers. Defeat the troll. Can do. Now I can get Master Armor. Yes. I've had that quest for God knows how long. Didn't see this. So fighting the giant's going to be interesting. Let's follow the man's tracks for now. See if we can't find our friend on crate. Damn, he went a long way, didn't he? Didn't get very far, though. Something up on the rock side. Ah! Giant's footprint. God, he's literally walked over half the island. He can't have been that fucking injured. I think we found him. Looks like he could be the right bloke. Fallen! I was sure you died. Where have you been? Ceres has gone to Speakerog. Alone. Couldn't wait. No. Had to sneak off. <laughs> as if you were a fear of someone to steal the giant out from under you. Ceres? She staked a claim to the throne then? And you'd have rather gone with her! 
I'd hmm. like to have the choice. Wait! Still need to thank you, Geralt of Rivia. I'll never forget you came to my aid. You know of me? You know me. Our bards sing ballads about you. My father told me of your adventures when I was a lad. I remember it well. You needn't be a witcher to be a hero. Cold water and a salty breeze. Those are a Skellige lad's potions. So that ballad about the witcher and the sorceress? That's you? Yeah. Yennefer. <laughs> Where's the rest of your crew? Fought our way through a swarm of sirens to get here. Only a handful of us left after that battle. Now we're but three. The sirens tore Leif up good. We should see to his wounds. He's dead. What? Nah, he's just unconscious. Lost a bit of blood. No, he's dead. He's dead. Trust me. Swore he'd sink his blade into the giant's heart. Swore on the bones of his ancestors. Still can. Coming with me? Stupid question. <laughs> yeah, we're not letting you go alone, mate. Join us, Geralt. Right, so we found Duncrate and a lot of silence from the sound of it. Pick up the pace. See you're rare to go. So what I am gonna do is Ooh, I was... I'm telling you, plowing enormous horse on he is. Wonderful. Yeah, what I'm going to do is end this episode here, and then next next episode we'll be going to take down that frost giant. So, thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and subscribe if you want to see more content like it. As always, there will be links to the full playlist in the description, and I hope to see you next time. Adios.